Wow. Scientific reductionist. What a great read that was. It just was doing some research. And uh, thank you for sharing that new open door of knowledge. And I just wanted to um, uh, just throw out some things that um, I kind of grabbed from your video and um, just kind of to bounce back. Um, Alright, so I came up, well I didn't come up with this quote but I edited it. <laughs> when you learn more and more about one thing until you know exactly everything about nothing, you have found your question to the answer of life. So, I think that really says everything. I mean, your whole video was a redundant circle, and scientific reduction actually doesn't make much sense to me. Um, science, the word, I believe, is Greek for knowledge. And how can you reduce knowledge? Because it's an ever-expanding territory, no matter which field you're looking at. And all of them happen to relate to one another and could not exist without the other. So I don't think reductionism would really play a role. I mean, you can certainly break them apart, but you're only going to find that you're back at the beginning again. I mean since the time we're born knowledge just explodes and we're forever learning until the day our lights go out um, and you know we can reduce our reality to the very point that we get hungry and need to eat and are distracted by our basic needs of survival um, which is in a materialistic kind of way I guess and I would like to call myself a materialistic reductionist, which is still so hard when we live in a world that is, um, at the moment, um, focused on consuming. But, um, huh, yeah, so basically I believe that when you reduce um, every little piece of something, you end up, you know, where you know nothing once again it's just you know you can't reduce everything because you're just gonna find yourself looking at yourself in the mirror you know like we're still who we are um, you know it's the ever illuminated micro macro way of life anyways I just wanted to thank you um, I enjoy knowledge and science and, and and expanding my brain and um, hopefully reducing my life so that I can figure out who and what I am and are here for um, and it's such a wonderful journey of always knowing that I'll never get it <laughs> unless I get it all and nothing at once alright thanks and have a wonderful wonderful evening you too, and you too, and especially you. Yeah. And I love you. Yeah.